Unlike in years past, there won't be any fireworks here in our area to begin the new year, but there are plenty of other ways to celebrate safely. Eyewitness News reporter Trang Dill reports now from the Blue Cross River Ring tonight. One, two, three. Happy New Year! <laughs> 2020 in a nutshell. <laughs> yeah. Amen. 2020 definitely had its fair share of stumbles, but many families tried to cap off a difficult year with some fun at Winterfest at Penn's Landing. I'm here to skate and have fun with my family. It's amazing. I love it. It's um, Christmassy still. It's fun. It's not too cold. The rain stopped for a little bit. So we are good. Tickets sold out for the entire day, even without the big fireworks shows this year. This is our seventh or eighth year doing this as, you know, a couple. These newlyweds made sure to keep their long standing date of skating at the river rink on New Year's Eve. We wanted to try to make sure we, we kept the tradition alive, especially because of what's going on, and, you know, with the pandemic and all. But we were happy that they stayed open. Though the city is discouraging gatherings of any kind this holiday to curb COVID 19, Winterfest organizers say there are many precautions in place to keep people safe. We have staff to make sure people have their masks on and worn properly. Properly above their nose. Uh, we have hand sanitizing stations all over the site and we have a uh, uh, very limited capacity. But for those being safest at home, the Police Touch Museum has posted a virtual 2021 countdown celebration on its website that you can watch anytime to account for those early bedtimes. Happy New Year! From Penn's Landing. I'm Trang Doe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.